Father, we do love you tonight. You are great, Lord God, and we stand before you just with humbled hearts. Father, we thank you for all that you've done in our lives. We know we wouldn't be standing here today without your goodness, without your mercy. And we just thank you, Father, you're the true and the living God. And we dedicate our lives afresh and anew to you right now. We thank you, Father, that everything we do will bring glory to your name, bring honor to your name. Lord, I just pray that we would make good decisions in life. Lord, you said if we need wisdom, we could ask of you and you'd freely give it to us. So, Father, I'm asking for all of us tonight for your wisdom. Help us to stay on the best path. I pray that our spiritual ears and eyes would always be sensitive to your voice, that we'd obey that still, small voice on the inside. And Lord, we just pray that you'd open up the right doors and close us the wrong doors. Father, draw the right people to us. Weed out those that shouldn't be there. Father, I pray that we'll make great decisions in the coming days and we'll see your goodness and your mercy even in greater ways. And Father, you know every need of every person tonight. I just pray, Father, as we're worshiping you, you would begin to meet those needs. I pray for those that are fighting sickness and disease. Lord, let your healing flow into them right now. We stand in faith with our brothers and sisters that are fighting sicknesses. And Lord, we know you made our bodies. There's nothing too hard for you. So right now, by faith, we just receive your healing. We thank you, Lord, that everything in our body, every cell, every organ, every joint, every ligament, our blood, everything about us, we believe right now it's getting better and better. Every day we're getting better. You said you would renew our youth like the eagles. You said with long life you would satisfy us. So, Father, we stand on those promises that we will see your goodness and mercy in our physical health, in our mental health, Lord, I pray for peace in our minds. I thank you, Father, just for calm and undisturbed minds. I thank you, Lord, that you help us to just rest in you. I thank you, Father, that you are guiding us, guarding us, protecting us. We believe even right now that you're making our crooked places straight. We know you honor those that honor you. So, Father, I just thank you for your strength tonight. I thank you for your wisdom. I thank you for your favor. Lord, I thank you that we are increasing in the good areas of our lives. We're increasing in your anointing, increasing in your favor, that we'll never get stuck in a rut. Father, we thank you that we are free from every addiction, free from every bad habit, every kind of bondage that would try to hold us back. Father, we believe that whom the sun sets free is free indeed. We believe even tonight, Father, that we are totally free that no addiction can hold on to us and we just receive it by faith. We say greater is he that's in us than he that's coming against us. Father, I thank you for a supernatural strength, a supernatural determination. Lord, we thank you it's not by might nor by power, but it's by your spirit. It's by your favor on our lives. And we just thank you tonight, Father. I pray, Father, that we see your goodness and we just declare it by faith. We are victors and not victims. We are strong in you and the power of your might. We are blessed. We cannot be cursed. Lord, I thank you that we will lend and not borrow. We are strong. We are anointed. We are equipped. We are well able to do what you've called us to do. Father, I thank you that 2008 will be our best year so far, a year of your goodness and mercy in greater ways. We believe it. We pray it in the name of Jesus. Can you give the Lord one more shout of praise tonight? Amen. Amen.